can't believe I found this spot. I've never been camping on the beach before. Oh. I'm gonna get to camp right on top of the ocean tonight. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna have a fire and I'm gonna make potatoes. Oh my goodness, this is so exciting. I've, I've never, never spent a night on the ocean before, never camped right on the beach. This is like a big deal, very big deal for me. This is so cool. I need to get in the water. I am too excited to actually change into my bathing suit. So we're just gonna do it in my sports bra and shorts. And honestly, I'm more comfortable swimming in that anyway. tides out so it didn't really get that deep but <laughs> it was warm it was warm
dinner is done. I just put everything away and my fire died on its own, but it's still, it's still warm to the touch, so. it's still pretty bright outside but um it is almost eight o'clock and i am going to get ready for bed because i want to be up early tomorrow because there's a really cool hike along the coast that i want to try and do so yeah also i broke my tripod so i'm gonna try and <laughs> fix that and then i'm gonna go to bed This thing has uh, seen hell. <laughs> this thing has seen quite a lot and it gets quite a lot of wear and tear. Maybe someday I'll get a better one, but this is what we're working with right now. I think that's it. I think we've got it. I think I'm gonna leave it to sit somewhere i'll leave it here i i can't even begin to tell you how much stuff i've hastily repaired or just left broken but yeah good vibes good vibes is already like full right now it is literally 6 a.m oh my god wow i got up at 4 30. oh my god 4 30 wasn't early enough oh my god i think a lot of these vehicles represent people who backpacked overnight and slept on the beach so Hopefully there won't be that many people on the trail, but yeah, we're gonna, I would like to do that someday. I would love to like start backpacking, but right now I simply, simply cannot afford $3 million worth of backpacking equipment. I don't know why it's always so expensive, but anyway.
we got marshy boardwalk. We love when the trail got marshy boardwalk. I, this is so gorgeous. Oh, and it smells really good. It smells like so wet and alive. I'm from the East Coast, I'm from New York, and I lived pretty far inland, so I never got to see the ocean that much. But whenever I did, you know, whenever, whenever you go to the ocean on the East Coast, it's a completely different and far more awful experience. <laughs> because a lot of the land on the East Coast isn't federally protected. The only places where it's federally protected are like, in northern Maine near Acadia National Park. The fact that this is a beautiful thriving forest and not a shopping mecca with a boardwalk just makes me so happy. And I know that the entire west coast isn't like this. I know that when you get into parts of Southern California, it gets a little bit more commercial, but uh, just the fact that this is here and that it's still so beautiful and well protected. I don't know what to say. <laughs> it's so beautiful. So many tiny crabs. So many. Yoink. Look at you. You're so cute. Here, go back. Bye bye. Oh, look, those are bear tracks. There was a sign at the beginning of this hike um, that there's a bear frequenting this area. Oh yeah, look at that. Those are recent too. So we might see a bear. We might see a bear. head back to the car I've got like three more miles to go and it'll be all forested from here this is the end of my beach time so yeah I'm tired I only got like three hours of sleep last night so yeah but I'm sleepy I am back at my car. That was really nice. It was a pretty easy 10 miles. There wasn't really any elevation gain. And 
yeah no i am really tired i didn't sleep well last night and i'm pretty hungry so honestly i think i'm gonna end the vlog here i'm just gonna like have some lunch and maybe take a nap but yeah i will catch up with you guys next time so bye bye